This is a very disturbing statistic. 40% of Oklahoma women, 40% will experience domestic violence in their lifetime. In downtown Oklahoma City, there is a place called Palomar that not only helps those victims find food, shelter, and safety, but also helps them navigate the legal process that follows. Join me and First Fidelity Bank as we pay it forward. I came um, to Palomar in June of 2019 looking for help a victim of domestic violence with nowhere to go, no one to turn to. And I just walked in the door and Laura happened to be the case manager that day. And it was no accident their paths crossed. Through the whole court process and, and counseling and just learning how to navigate my life after all of that, she stood beside me. When you're in that situation um, and you don't have any hope, Sometimes a kind word and a gentle hand um, is just enough to keep you going. It's been four years since Paula first stepped foot into these doors. And even though she no longer needs the services provided by Palomar, the strength she slowly gained here and the gratitude for this place of refuge will never go away. Palomar is amazing. Um, you know, like I said, the second that you walk through the door, there's never any judgment. Um, they make sure that you're safe. You know, they walk you through the process. If you don't know um, about the court system, they have helped to do that. Um, if you're having um, utility issues, housing issues, there's people here and advocates here. To help navigate the often rocky waters that so often lie ahead, the unfortunate aftermath of domestic violence. And I just don't want to let her forget, you know, that she's seen the work that the counselors and the case managers do here at Palomar, we see you. And that's why Paula nominated Laura for Pay It Forward. Lynn Cross with First Fidelity Bank. First Fidelity loves to recognize people that give back to our community, and Laura McDonald represents everything that Pay It Forward is about. It is my pleasure to give you this $400 on behalf of First Fidelity Bank. We give Paula the money and find Laura, who thinks she's here just for a quick visit. Have you been wondering why you were taking a tour? Yes. Hey, Laura. Hi. Hi, I'm Jolene Cheney with Hi, News 4. We have a program called Pay It Forward. Oh. And Paula nominated you for all the work you've done here for so many women, and she wants to recognize you. I love you so much. For all your hard work, and for standing beside me and all of your clients while you were here at Palomar and working with Y, I'd like to pay forward. Paula. So you have to hold your hand out. You have to hold your hand out. I got into this work because domestic violence really impacted a very close friend of mine. And walking with her through that journey and seeing all the barriers that are in survivor's ways. It just kind of lit this fire in me. It's that something that's very close to my heart and I always, like, I think once an advocate, always an advocate. Palomar saved my life. It's that simple. A wonderful place providing much needed services. What an invaluable yes. service they provide yeah. here. 40%. That's bad to bad stat for Oklahoma. Yes. For more information about Palomar and the services they do provide, we have a link on our website at kf4r.com as well as how you can nominate someone for Pay It Forward. And if you know someone making a difference like you just saw, we want to meet them. You can nominate them at kfor.com slash pay it forward.